my six month skateboard progression video. I hope you enjoy it. Look at me do this weird feet stamp here. Hiya! <laughs> and like, my drop in goes off to the side. Uh, so, here yeah, I'm actually doing the five step method of um, how to ollie. So, this is like my second time, third time at the park maybe. front sides so bad. Even to this day, my kick turns are so bad. Now, I didn't get to show me doing a few freestyle tricks like monster walks and endovers. And learning how to pump took so long. I like this. Huh? <laughs> this was a really cool little spot to practice rock to fakies. Yeah, Shin. This guy's so awesome. This is just, this took so long to get to finally Oli over something. Ah. I was so happy. <laughs> no way. That's ah, cool. What's funny is I actually did this drop in first try but then when it was time for the camera <laughs> I failed I like this little pump track thing so yes I finally stopped doing the nose grab This thing's really cool. I saw someone do it, so I was like, oh, I want to give that a shot. Sometimes that's what skateboard is all about. Seeing someone else do it first, and then you're like, oh, it's possible. Yeah, so, only today I realize I've been ollieing wrong. Like I'm supposed to use my ankle. But my ollies here is like I push my foot down. But I'm not actually using my ankle. But, you know, they've been sort of sufficient enough. Yeah, Sarah Park Matot. Love her channel. I learned so much from her. And um, her, her skateboard progression video is so great, she's amazing. I, I have nothing bad to say about her. I'm even a Patreon. I learned how to no comply from her channel. This is at the Museum of Australia. I haven't even gone to the museum. But this, this part is so dope. Got it, bro. Oh! Yes. 
<laughs> so, kickflips actually didn't take too long for me to learn, funnily enough. I'd say I probably spent about four sessions before I finally uh, landed one. Somebody got me, somebody got me. Oh man, learning to drop in Switch. It's so oh. fun dropping in Switch. <laughs> My motivation for dropping in Switch was like, oh. when I was teaching someone how to drop in, I was like, all right, no, I might, might as well pretend I'm a beginner as well. And, and so do it in Switch. So that way I could teach them. Yes, Ishii, what a great friend. Such a cool person to skate with. Helicopter, helicopter. Para cofer, para cofer. Sorry. <laughs> So, there's so many um, freestyle lines that I made up that I didn't include because the video was already getting too long. This is a nice indoor place. I went to this indoor place when it was like super rainy. I still gotta learn how to do board slides. Man, Axel stores took me so long to get. Like, maybe a month or two months. And right there is my first one. I think the 180 bonus looks so cool. Here we get higher and higher tail stalls. It's probably one of my favorite tricks, the tail stall. This was crazy, like I did some tricks first try here, like this half cab thing, I never really did that, I just did it just then. Oh my god, it's like everything! <laughs> Here's my first grinds. Next up I gotta try Ollie into it. So here's like a frontside 170. <laughs> Always gotta add the peace sign guys. We come in peace. Oh hi, thanks for checking in. I'm still a piece of garbage. Here we go. Here we go. I gotta say, I look so cool without protection. <laughs> You can do it! Uh, that guy in the background in the black, I asked him if he could do it. Here we go! Oh, oh my god! And that motivated me to try it.
one week later. Oh, first try! <laughs> Firecrackers is such a dangerous move to learn. I like super badly injured my shoulder. Doing a five stair firecracker. Twice I turn my back on you. Go. I fell flat on my face with it in the Ooh! Did it! So tell me where did I go? No comply 180 here. Look how bad my switch pushing is. To tail still. Pretty birds. Or oh, monster walks, I'm not sure. Range plants are one of my favorite tricks. Here we go. Ready? Ranch plant. See, like my, my ankle doesn't really push the board down to get a pop. So the reason why I wear a cap backwards or forwards is because I sweat a lot. And when I sweat my hair gets really curly. I don't like it curly. Oh man, I've always thought he'd be jumping that thing. Like ever since I came to the park, I was like, that's gonna be doable. something I don't really do that often. That was cool. 180 hippie jump. This is such a hard trick and freestyles make it look so easy. Stationary man. What's crazy is you can do a lot of transition tricks with this um, tiny freestyle board. Not only is it thin, it's also really short. So this is the infamous spider bowl. Thanks for watching my YouTube video. I know it was kinda long. <laughs> Glad you stayed and made it to the end. Follow me on Instagram, subscribe to me, and follow my TikTok. <laughs> I'll see you in the next video.